right, everyone, we will start with questions in the room. Please make sure you raise your hand, get my attention before asking your question. We'll start now. Yep, Craig. Were you nervous during that match at all? Um, I wouldn't say I was nervous, no. Karen? What do you think was the difference today? Um, the difference today was errors. I made a... I made so many errors today, so um, it was honestly it was opportunities where I could have won, I could have been up five love, and I just made so many errors. So, could you have imagined you had not a single forehand winner in the first set? Yeah, but I had a lot of forehand unforced errors, so it was, um, it was a. Big error day for me today. Go ahead, Nick. Justin, how did you feel this morning? How was your warm up? Did you feel like you were hitting the ball well, or how did you actually walk onto the match court feeling about your game? Yeah, I felt well. I felt like I was hitting well. I was hitting well this whole tournament. Um, even the first couple games, I played well, and even then, I had so many opportunities. And um, yeah, so it was just, I don't know. Yeah, it was just. Just made too many mistakes there, and easy mistakes. Not like they were, I was on the run or anything. They're just easy, easy mistakes. Go ahead, Matt. What, what do you take away from this, <coughs> excuse me, the experience of the last few weeks in terms of what's both gonna be required of you personally to you know, pursue tennis over the next six months while we deal with this pandemic, and also just you know, in terms of the sport in general? Um, in terms of the, the complications of, of everything that's involved, just getting to this point. Um, yeah, I don't. I feel like um, I haven't really thought about that so much, but I think um, going through last year with the pandemic was definitely interesting, and so I have a little experience under my belt with that, I guess. But um, yeah, those are things that I haven't really thought about. Karen. to a standing ovation and you put your hand over your heart what was going through your head in that moment um i don't know the aussie crowd is so amazing so it was nice to see some people wondered if this is you were almost saying farewell um <laughs> i don't know if i if i ever say farewell i wouldn't tell anyone so, <laughs> so. Uh, last couple questions in the room, please. Yeah, Craig, then. Gene is saying about the, the unforced error 